Hi, I'm Calvin Reeder from Ontario, Canada. Imagine not having enough water and having to walk hours a day just to obtain it. This is what millions of people have to do and it dominates their lives. In my project, I've designed systems that are capable of producing clean drinking water without running costs, a carbon footprint, or a requirement for existing infrastructure. I've designed two systems, and the first is an atmospheric water condenser. The, con the condenser consists of a high internal surface area for condensation and is made of, of a high thermal conductivity material, aluminum. Now, cooling is key to this system, and so it consists of three components to increase the natural rate of cooling. The first is a photon shield, which reflects away radiation from the surroundings. The second is a high emissivity radiating panels, which reflect away thermal radiation to the sky. And the final one is a parabolic reflector array, which increases the natural rate of radiative cool. At night, the, the surfaces of the condenser are cooled to below the ambient dew point, which is the temperature needed for condensation to occur and water condenses on the surfaces and flows into the base where it can be collected. This pilot scale system produces water and results indicate that it can potentially produce up to 2.65 liters per night. The second system I've designed is a novel solar still. In this I've adapted the condenser component from the atmospheric water condenser system. Now 95% of traditional solar stills consist of a single basin filled with contaminated water with a sloped glass cover. However, these are inefficient. My system consists of the condensing surfaces connected to multiple evaporating basins. Solar energy ev evaporates contaminated water in the basins, which condense in the condensing surfaces and flow into the base where it could be collected. These work more efficiently than traditional solar stills and completely convert non-potable to potable drinking water.